Congratulations to Respawn for releasing Titanfall 2. And also making the quickest intro screens ever. Seriously, producers ooh, listed, and there you go, you're already in. And uh, one problem though is the multiplayer. What is the issue? Well, I had an issue with it for quite a while and I couldn't figure it out because nobody knew what the issue was. A lot of people were having issues with this and the biggest fix for it was finally found. It was posted online in a dumb little article, but now I'm gonna show you what the fix is. And right now I'm using DX Tori to record the game, but I'll be switching to OBS to show my monitor because Shadow Play for some reason won't let me record it. So you might see, Jeez, it's taking a real time for the data center to search. Jeez, it's taking a long time to contact respawn servers. Well, that's just that. It's never going to be fixed. If you go into the campaign and play it for a bit, eventually the option comes off, and you're like, oh, hey, it's not grayed out now, and I can go in. Nope, it's going to come up with arrow, error code 408, infamous in the Titanfall community. And I am going to teach you how to fix this little problem because it annoyed the shit out of me. Alright, so here we are in OBS, and uh, as you can see, it's still not working. So let me show you what the dumbest fix ever is. It may not be available, I don't really care. Um, this little thing, right here. Your internet adapters. You might see, I don't use e Ethernet, I use Wi-Fi. And even though I don't use e Ethernet, that is what's stopping me from getting on. So you need only one adapter active, literally. So all you do is disable it. That's all you gotta do. Alright, so quickly found the way. Pretty much you go to control panel, open up your control panel, go down here, go wherever. If you're using Windows 8, you have a search bar, get that control panel going. Then you go network and internet, click on network and sharing center, and you will see that's that, and then you click on the left side, change adapter settings, and that is where you will find it. Once you disable it, that's all you gotta do. You just leave your one thing that you use for internet, close that out, you don't need it again. Start up Titanfall 2. Titanfall 2 is gonna start up, we had to watch the wonderful intro. OBS took a bit to realize that something opened up, I guess. And... Respawn Entertainment. Now we just wait. Now you just wait. Wait for it to connect. It's gonna take a lot less time than I showed on the menu. But it will be done. There you go, it's already done. That, I didn't even edit it. Didn't edit it at all. So as you can see, this is just the common issue with Titanfall 2. I haven't even played multiplayer yet because I wanted to get this video up and show you guys what the issue was. So, thank you guys for watching. Do whatever. Yeah, and I hope to see you in game. See ya.